let's go to Surrey in England and talk to May about Saudi Arabia. May, welcome to the show. Uh, yes, hello. Um, I'm talking to you as a Sunni Muslim, and I have a message for the House of Saud. I want to tell these Wahhabis that they do not represent me. They do not represent our Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. They do not represent Islam. They do not represent the Arab world. And it is thanks to them, with their secret treaties back in the 1920s, that allowed them to give Palestine away to the Zionists who are um, squatting in my homeland. I want to tell the House of Saud that they have destroyed Arabia, they have insulted our faith, they are stealing our money, uh, billions that they get from the Hajj, which should have been used um, to benefit all the Muslims, but instead, as you have um, already stated, they are squandering the wealth which belongs to the people, which belongs to Muslims worldwide. And another thing that isn't known is the fact that the House of Saud are destroying a lot of our historical uh, monuments and relics which are linked to our uh, beloved Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. And I think it is an outrage. And it is about time that the Muslim world woke up and removed these people. The House of Saud have no right to be the custodians of Islam in Mecca and Medina. They have no right, no right whatsoever. And it is time that the Islamic world woke up. And I have the utmost contempt also for our Muslim ulema in, uh, in uh, Arabia and elsewhere. Where, where are their fatwas? Where are their fatwas when it comes to the destruction of Palestine? Where was their fatwa? for the destruction in Iraq and Libya, and now they're trying to repeat the same thing in Syria. Where are these fatwas, these, these pathetic fatwas that these imams pass in, in Arabia? Uh, for instance, they're saying that we, we, we shouldn't go out and demonstrate. I'm sorry, but um, God Almighty told us and our Prophet told us that if you see injustice, you must do something to stop it. If you can, cannot stop it physically, you must stop it through word of mouth. And if you can't stop it through word of mouth, then you must curse in your heart. And I'll tell you something, I will curse these people till the day I die, and I look forward to their removal from Mecca and Medina because they are venom in, in, in Arabia. And we should stop calling it Saudi. It is Arabia. These people usurped Arabia from the righteous people of Arabia, the, from the Muslims. Thank you very much. Well, I must say, May, that may be the most magnificent call in a hundred editions or two hundred editions. I forget how many we've had, but in all the years I've been doing comment, that may be the most powerful call I have ever heard. And I hope that people capture it on YouTube and on Facebook. I hope people tweet about it. I hope people spread your call to the ends of the earth because it was so magnificent you almost made me cry.